in this example we have x, open parens, and then I'm going to have four terms, w not, ord with x, ord with y not, ord with z. All right, let's multiply this out. We get x and w not, ord with x, x, ord with x, y not, ord with x, z. All right, let's simplify now. I have x ended with an x. Oh, immediately I know if you have an AND gate, and x is 1, then you have a 1 and a 1. If x is 0, you're going to have a 0 for an output. So whatever x is, that's what your output's going to be. Ah, so this guy always reduces x ended with itself, always reduces to itself, x. So now I have x, w naught, ORD with X, ORD with X, Y not, ORD with X, Z. Huh, this is doable. Now, let me just, whoops, let me just move this over a little bit and get some fighting room because I'm going to need it. There we go. All right, let's start with these two. Let's factor x out of these two terms. So I get x times what gives me w naught? And the answer is w naught. Bring down the or. x times what gives me x? Answer 1. Ah, let's work this right out to the bitter end here. If you OR anything with a 1, what are you going to do? get? You're going to get a 1 all the time. Now I have X ANDED with a 1. If you AND anything with a 1, what are you going to get? You're going to get that anything all the time. Let's bring these guys down. Plus X, Y, not plus x, y not. We'll bring them down one at a time. Bring this guy down first. Whoops. I missed. Strike one. There we go. So now, x ORD with x, y not. Ah! x and a x. I can factor x out of both terms. x times what gives me x? 1. Bring down the or. x times what gives me x, y not? The answer is y not. Alright, if you or anything with a 1, what are you going to get? A 1 all the time. So this reduces to a 1 again. And now you have x ANDED with a 1. If you AND anything to a 1, what are you going to get? You're going to get whatever that anything is. In this case, x. Ah, that was beautiful. Okay, let's bring this term down. Over to here. And what was that term? It was OR X Z. So OR X Z. Huh. All right. This looks like the other uh, terms that we were simplifying. All right. So now I have X OR with X Z. Common factor in both of these terms is X. Let me pull that out. X times what gives me X? 1. Bring down the OR. Now, x times what gives me x, z? And the answer is z. 
All right. Now, if you or anything with a 1, what are you always going to get? 1. It's pretty bad looking to see there. There we go. So if you or anything with a 1, you get a 1. Bring down the x. If you and anything with a 1, what are you going to get? You're going to get that anything. Whatever that thing is, you're ending with a 1, you're going to get it, that anything. There you go. We've now reduced this entire expression of x times w not ord with x ord with y not ord with z to x. Reduce that whole big thing to x. Wow. And that is amazing. This is George Bull.